your bungalow. Thank you. Oops. <laughs> this lift extends so far. Isn't it pretty good? <laughs> go. Let him get the tip, honey. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't want you to lose a finger. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. All right, good job. Right. Yeah. If you want, I can get pictures Ready? of both oh. of you. Yeah. Oh, right. Fish and alligators and well, that would be a battle. Yeah, they're litter mates. We have a male lion. They trade which stays there on exhibit because currently they're too small to hold their own litter But the plan is to introduce them when they're ready. Okay. Hi. Hi. Hi, sweet girl. <laughs> <laughs> And these are the ones. We had a we had honey. Go for it. Alright, one, two, three, cheese. Oh, good job. So you guys, you guys can see that big old hump on the back of his neck. Um, oh. when he lifts it, you will see it gives him a few more inches of height. It is a muscle whose sole purpose is to lift his big heavy head. Um, semen from the last northern male white rhino oh, that died right, back in 2018. So then basically okay. do, you know, <laughs> test tube baby and then okay. inseminate a white rhino. Okay. And so with the two females that are still alive, that's what happened. Yes. And they're in a um, conservation preserve in Kenya. Yeah, Jiggly. and picture. <laughs> That's all one muscle right there. Jiggle it. He's got a very flat snout. Uh, about oh, 15 to 20. Hi, hi Zaya girl. Hi. She's now, a flirt. Occurring, so this is happy. Yeah, she's such a flirt. <laughs> Zaya girl. Zaya girl. <laughs> Good girl. Oh. Zaya girl. Because she knows. I don't know how you all don't just want to spend all day in there. Oh, I do. I <laughs> This is Eddie. He is our spotted hyena. I think he's almost 14. Hi, Eddie. Oh, yeah. Hyenas are typically very <laughs> Hi, Presley. Oh, you're amazing. I'm in love. <laughs> cousins, two raccoons. They are white nosed Kawada Mundis. Whoa! Oh, my goodness gracious. I saw this on one of the videos too. Yeah. Okay. They are seed dispersers, so they're terrible pets. 
Okay. Oh my. Hi. <laughs> Should I remove my no, hat? You're fine. Okay. <laughs> it makes it more fun for her. <laughs> so, like I said, she is a black and white ruffed lemur. So, she's got that beard that gets pollen all over it so she can pollinate. <laughs> I can see what you mean about don't move because I feel like I should. You want to like lean to a Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Goodness, look at that lemur. <laughs> I love primate hands because they're so much like ours and they're soft. They're incredibly soft. So lemurs are the lower level primates. Um, they're not quite as intelligent compared to others. Um, like they are very aware. Um, they are extremely intelligent. He's about 20 years old. And being an old man. So Pippin and uh, Penny are um, yellow. They're really excellent yeah. pets. And then five years later, they're this size and they live for another 80 years. Yeah, they are. Are you with someone? So big. Gotcha, thanks. So these guys, um, they grew up at our director's house. But these guys, um, they're brown, they don't quite move in and up in the trees. So what they'll do is if they grow allergy on their back. As much as I would like to work with her. I know, I'm like seeing all of the protective necessities. I want your shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to move my hair for you. <laughs> she is a primate like us, so she's got hands really similar to us. She's got four fingers, a thumb, fingerprints, fingernail. Her back feet are a little bit different because she's got a modified back foot with an opposable thumb, so she can hang by just her back feet. All right, so this is a cavy, also known as a Patagonia Mara. They're the fourth largest road in the world. You guys know what the world's largest road is? Here. The capybara. Yep, 150 yeah. pounds. So these guys top out about 25 to 30 pounds. Those capybaras get up to 150 pounds. So I'll keep this pointy end towards me. This is a striped skunk, you guys. Her name is Mocha, and her coloring is a little different. She was actually brought to us from a breeder. Yeah. Do you guys have any guesses as to what he is? Oh, alpaca. alpaca. Yes. So <laughs> the alpacas, llamas, and camels are all part of the camelid family. The camel. Oh. You're good. Oh. I know. So the camelid family is going to have that split upper lip and that split toe. That split upper lip will allow them to go through and forge <laughs> through the grasses and treetops and find exactly what they want to eat. And like, they're very like, I know, I know. He's scared, but he comes to you. It's Aww. really cute. Aww. Thanks. So Odin is what we call a royal white tiger. That is because where they are from in Asia, they are seen as a status symbol, or they were a couple hundred years ago. But because it is just a color mutation, they are still a tiger. It's just like black labs and yellow labs. They're all still dogs. They're just different colors. So they were rare in the wild, probably? They're extremely rare in the wild because they lose their most important feature, which is their camouflage. So you're going to need a white. You're going to punch down. Mm -hmm. huh. wonder if they ever get like a half and half. Um, that does occur. Again, it's just colors. Mm -hmm. 
Wow. And she's about six feet tall when she's standing. Um, for one, have you guys ever had two dogs or two cats that can't eat in the same room? Uh. It's because Raj is very food aggressive and Mo understands sooner comes tomorrow, so she likes to take her time and taste the food. So as I put meat patties down, you can just keep going and she's going to have a pile. <laughs> so, what makes these two so special? So they've just been together their whole lives and yes. No. They're not blood related, but they've been raised uh -huh. as if they were. So yeah. now you will yeah. hear our lions talking to each other, trying to get the last word. Their roars are a lot more of a okay. bellow. It comes more from the belly. Yeah. Um, not as majestic oh, hold on. <laughs> as Hollywood would like. And they do that at night? They do that at sunset and I'm sunrise. Still going on So Archie Rhino is in here as you walked in, that's Bash, and the one making his way over his water bowl right now is Billy Ray at his face. Stranger okay. Dave. Change. So the goal was to have them come join our group. So just remember, hey, slow things down, take that sacred pause, and enjoy life. Thanks.